Hello and welcome. This is Kendra and it's time to announce the winners for Kendra's card challenge number 10. This is a quarterly card making challenge that started on April 1st and ended on June 30th of 2023. If you're not familiar with the challenge, I provide a free printable that contains cutting guides and card sketches where you can make a bunch of cards with just six sheets of six inch by six inch pattern paper plus other card stock and supplies. It's a great way to use up those pattern papers that you have in your stash. And by sharing the cards, you can have a chance to win lots of prizes from the awesome company prize sponsors that you see here. The challenges are open to card makers worldwide. And for challenge number 10, we had 476 entries from card makers who live in the different countries shown here on the screen. Now, if you're watching this during the premiere, I hope you'll join me in the live chat for a chance to win some digital printables. Introduce yourself, tell me where you're watching from, and feel free to ask any questions you may have for me. Be sure to complete the form pinned at the top of the chat to enter to win. I will showcase all of the June entries first, and these were submitted to the Kendra's Card Challenges Facebook group. If you'd like to see the cards for April and May, you can find the videos here on my channel. I'll be going through these fairly quickly, but remember you can always take a look at the entries in the Facebook group under the photo albums. Now, if you're not watching this video during the premiere and you're here to see if you're a winner, please feel free to skip ahead if you don't want to see all of the wonderful card making inspiration I'm about to share. As mentioned before, we had 476 entries for Challenge 10. Plus, there were a lot of videos posted on YouTube featuring the cards made using Challenge 10. If you want to check out these videos, you can do a search on YouTube using the hashtag Kendra's Card Challenge 10 or KCC10 to find them. The giveaway prize I'm giving away to three lucky commenters during the premiere of this video for those participating in the live chat is the June of 2023 bonus printable, which is a template with instructions on how to make a card gift box that will hold your set of A2 cards. It pairs perfectly with the challenge because it can hold up to 15 cards, depending on how much dimension you have on your cards anyway, but I'll be selecting the winners at the end of this video during the premiere. Now, if you're new to my channel and you didn't get to participate in challenge number 10 or any of the other previous card challenges, you can still get access to the printables over on my Patreon page when you join as a patron. If you become a supporter of my challenges, you'll have access to all of my previous card challenge printables, one through 10, for only $5 a month. In addition, you'll get a handmade card from me each month, plus access to a printer-friendly version of the current challenge printable. As an all-access patron for $10 a month, you'll get access to the monthly bonus printables and early access to my card challenges. And as a VIP patron for $25 a month, you'll get everything I already mentioned, plus a card making kit and a live craft session with me each quarter. Plus, starting with challenge 11, there will be giveaway prizes exclusively for patrons, other bonus printables that you'll get instant access to if you join as an all-access patron, or VIP patron include digital papers, digital stamps, digital card making kits, one sheet wonder files, fun fold tutorials, and more. It's definitely worth it to join as a member. If you're not already a patron, I hope you'll consider joining and you can cancel at any time. Your membership helps to support my work and helps keep the challenges free for all to enjoy each quarter. In addition, to the time that it takes to put these challenges together, I also purchase many of the giveaway prizes for the hops and some of the monthly prizes, and the shipping costs add up. So any support you can give is greatly appreciated. I will place a link to my Patreon page down in the description box below. Another way to help support my work is to purchase a super thanks on any of my YouTube videos. These are like virtual tip jars. If you're on a computer, you'll find the heart with a dollar sign next to thanks by clicking on the three dots next to download under the video. And if you're on a mobile device, you should see this thanks option below my name, but above the comments. You should also see this as an option if you're watching the premiere and you're in the live chat. So if you don't want to commit to a monthly amount by joining as a patron, you can send me a thanks here on YouTube. Facebook also has something similar where you can give stars on videos and posts as a way to support pages. If you're not already following my page at Cards by Kendra on Facebook, I would love it if you would follow me there. I'm also on Instagram and TikTok. If you happen to share your creations on any of these social media channels, please feel free to tag me so I can see your cards and follow you. I have links to all of my socials in the description below. 
I want to invite you to join us on challenge number 11, which was posted on July 1st. This quarterly contest ends on September 30th of 2023. And just like with challenge 10, you can make 15 cards with six sheets of six by six paper. Please watch my Kendra's Card Challenge 11 introduction video if you haven't already. It includes tips, how to enter the challenge, how to cut the papers, plus additional information that you'll need to know and possibly some answers to questions you may have. To enter the challenge, join the Kendra's Card Challenges Facebook group. You'll need to agree to some group rules before you'll be approved, but once you're in, you'll want to upload your photo of all 15 cards to one of the three official entry photo albums for Challenge 11. There's one for each month in the quarter. You can enter once per month, so up to three times per challenge. But please feel free to share all of your creations on the Facebook group wall if you decide to do more. We always love to see more card making inspiration. Now, Due to some of the prizes needing to be shipped, please include your name and country of residence in your photo caption when you upload your photos to the official entry photo albums. I will have to filter the entries for U.S. participants for certain prizes. In the featured posts at the top of the Kendra's Card Challenges Facebook group, you will find instructions on how to locate and post to the photo albums using both a computer and a mobile device. It's important that you post in the photo albums so that I can locate your entry. Just posting your photo on the group wall does not count as an entry. There are also separate photo albums for each card sketch where you can share a photo of each card individually. Uploading individual card photos isn't a requirement to be entered to win one of the quarterly prizes, but this is how you would enter to win one of the monthly sketch prizes. Plus, everyone can see the cards up close a little better. What's great about the individual albums is that you can post the pictures as you finish them throughout the quarter and still be eligible to win the sketch prizes even if you don't get to finish all 15 cards. If you're not on Facebook, you can upload your photo using the form linked on my website to officially enter the challenge, but please note that these entries will not be included in my monthly video showcases. If you upload your creations to other social media platforms using the hashtags Kendra's Card Challenge 11 and KCC 11, others can see your creations and be inspired. So I hope you'll share your cards with us on your own Facebook page, Instagram, TikTok, Pinterest, or YouTube. Hashtags allow you to search for cards made with the challenge on each of the platforms. So if you're looking for more examples or inspiration, this is a great resource. If you haven't checked out all of the card making inspiration that is part of the KCC 11 giveaway video hop here on YouTube, it runs through July 9th. Each of the video design team members share the card making process for each of the 15 card sketches in this challenge and you have a chance to win a goodie bag filled with card making supplies valued at over $100. I hope you'll hop along to get some wonderful ideas and tips for challenge 11 and have a chance to win. In addition, we have an Instagram hop going on through July 10th, where a few members of the new inspiration team have shared projects made with the first five sketches for challenge 11. You can have another chance to win a prize over on Instagram for hopping along. Members of the inspiration team will be sharing projects to show how the sketches can be used beyond the challenge in everyday card making, scrapbooking, tags, home decor, and more. They will be posting on a variety of social media platforms throughout the quarter, so I hope you'll click on the link to my design team member page that's in the description box below. Here you will find a list of all the members links for both the video team and the inspiration team. I hope you'll follow them to find additional card making inspiration. We will also be doing Instagram hops several times each month throughout the quarter where you can have a chance to win even more prizes. These hops will showcase creations made with products from some of the Kendra's Card Challenges prize sponsors and the card sketches from Challenge 11. All of these events will be posted in the Facebook group, so if you don't want to miss out, make sure you turn on notifications within the group on Facebook. After I showcase all of the entries, the winners for Challenge 10 will be shown. And if you are a winner, you will need to claim your prize within seven days. If prizes are not claimed, I will do a redraw of the prizes and will announce those winners on my community page here on YouTube after July 15th. Again, if you're watching this video during the premiere and you missed the beginning, make sure you complete the form pinned at the top of the live chat and also comment to have a chance to win the June of 2023 bonus printable, which is an A2 card gift box. 
I'm going to put on some music while I showcase the rest of the entries and I'll join you back here in just a bit. Thank you so much for watching the showcase. I've really enjoyed seeing everyone's cards. I hope you have too. I hope you're inspired to get creative. Now I'll announce the winners for sketches 11 through 15. They will receive a bonus printable and a handmade card from me. Now let's pick the prize winners for the June monthly prizes. I'm using willofnames.com to randomly select the winners and I have all the names of those who have entered the challenge here on this spreadsheet. I'll first select the monthly winners for the prizes that will have to be shipped. I've sorted the June entries by country and I'm just going to copy those in the USA and paste them over into the box. 
let's spin and see who the prize winners are. I place the prize that is won in the bottom left hand corner. And the winner for the first stamp set from Colorado Craft Company is Kelly Meyer. Congratulations, Kelly. And the winner for the second stamp set from Colorado Craft Company is Wendy McMichael. Congratulations, Wendy. And the winner for the This Calls for Confetti mix is Brenda Pace. Congratulations, Brenda. And the winner for the first paper pad from me is Jenny Fu. Congratulations, Jenny. Now for the second paper pad. Second paper pad winner is Paula McLean. Congratulations, Paula. And the winner for the third paper pad is Beverly Stotts. Congratulations, Beverly. Now let's see who the winners are for the loaded envelopes. And the first winner is... Stacy Eaton. Congratulations, Stacy. And the second winner for the loaded envelope is Katie Har Weeks. Congratulations, Katie. And for the third winner for the loaded envelope and the final prize for June for prizes that need to be shipped, the winner is Rebecca Jerkins. Congratulations, Rebecca. Now let me come back over here to the spreadsheet and select all of the June entries that were not in the USA and I'll add those to the list of names that's already in my wheel of names over here. I'll add that to the bottom and then I will shuffle these names up and spin. Let's see who the Winner is for the $25 digital download voucher to Pokadoodles. And the winner is Karen. Congratulations, Karen. Now let's see who the winner is for the TLC Designs digital download of choice. And the winner is Brie Barron. Congratulations, Brie. And now let's see who the winner is for the $20 gift certificate to Uniquely Creative. And the winner is Kathy Folk. Congratulations, Kathy. Now let's pick the winners for the quarterly prizes. I have taken all of the entries on my spreadsheet and I've sorted them by country and for these first three prizes I'm only selecting the ones that are in the USA because these first three prizes have to be shipped and I'm copying those into Wheel of Names this box here and I'll shuffle these up it's there's a lot of names so it's taken a minute here so there we go that wheel looks kind of crazy doesn't it all right, let's spin and see who the winner is for the $25 prize pack from Pink and Maine. And the winner is Nina Belanco Boyer. Congratulations, Nina. 
Now let's see who the first winner is for a stamp and die set from Prickly Pear. And the winner is Carrie Darland. Congratulations, Carrie. Now let's see who the second winner is for the stamp and die set from Prickly Pear. And the winner is Daria Sikorsky. Congratulations, Daria. Now I'll go back over here to the spreadsheet and select all of the other entries for Kendra's card challenge number 10. So bear with me. I'm just gonna start from the bottom and highlight up, copy these over and add them to the bottom of the list. It's gonna make the wheel look even more crazy. <laughs> There we go. And I'll shuffle them. Sorry, I keep scrolling too far. Let's see who the winner is for the first Alta New $15 gift certificate. And the winner is Letty Barnes. Congratulations, Letty. Now the winner for the second $15 gift certificate to Alta New is Dina Joy Hildebrand. Congratulations, Dina. Now the winner for the TLC Designs $10 gift certificate. And the winner is Jeanette. I'm not even gonna try to pronounce the last name there. Congratulations, Jeanette. Let's see who the winner is for the $25 gift certificate to Katherine Pooler. And the winner is Margaret McKay. Congratulations, Margaret. And the winner for the $25 gift card to Gina K Designs. Is Linda Jean Bead. Congratulations, Linda. And the winner for the Cat Scrappiness $25 gift certificate is Nettie Sellen. Congratulations, Nettie. And the winner for the $25 gift certificate to Lawn Fawn is Michelle Harlemert. Congratulations, Michelle. Now the winner for the $25 gift certificate to Not Too Shabby. And the winner is Wendy Wagerman-Smith. Congratulations, Wendy. And the winner for the $25 gift certificate to Pear Blossom Press is Tiffany Hill Hunt. Congratulations, Tiffany. And the winner for the $30 gift certificate to Artful Angel is Candy Rogers. Congratulations, Candy. And the winner for the $20 gift certificate to Craft and Kimmy Stamps is Rachel Schofield. Congratulations, Rachel. And the winner for the $25 gift certificate to Craft Scrappy Tales Crafts is Danielle Hassmiller. Congratulations, Danielle. Now the winner for the $50 gift certificate to Poco Doodles is
Gail Otto. Congratulations, Gail. Now the winner for the $25 gift certificate to This Calls for Confetti is... Jackie Minahan. Congratulations, Jackie. And the winner for the $50 gift certificate to Sweet November Stamps is... Avery Murphy. Congratulations, Avery. And the final prize is the $50 gift certificate to Whimsy Stamps. And the winner is... Donna Ward. Congratulations, Donna. Congratulations to all of the winners. Winners, please complete the form linked in the description box below by July 15th to claim your prize. I want to thank everyone who participated in the challenge. I've really enjoyed seeing everyone's cards. If you do the math, there were over 7,100 cards made using Challenge 10, which is totally awesome. I'd also like to take a moment to thank all of the prize sponsors for Challenge 10. I'm so grateful for your generosity and support of my card challenges. I hope you all can join us again for the new quarterly card challenge number 11 that runs from July 1st through September 30th. The new PDF is available for download at kendrascardchallenges.com. All of our wonderful prize sponsors have agreed to sponsor the prizes again for this quarterly challenge. Plus we have a new prize sponsor, Crafty Meraki. They will be giving away a $25 gift certificate each month throughout the quarter. Don't forget about the KCC 11 giveaway video hop here on YouTube happening now through July 9th and the KCC 11 sketch hop over on Instagram now through July 10th. You don't want to miss all of the inspiration that everyone on the creative team has to share with you. I'd like to take a moment to thank all of my current patrons. I really appreciate your generosity and support. If you're not already a patron, I hope you will consider joining this fun membership program. Before we go, I wanted to share what the July of 2023 bonus printable is. It's a set of 30 different digital pattern papers, plus 42 sentiments and a bunch of different occasions to match the Challenge 11 sketches. There are five different sets of six coordinating pattern papers in fun colors. I want to thank you all for watching all the way to the end of this video. I would love it if you'd share the challenge with your crafty friends to help me spread the word. I hope you can join us on the next challenge and I can't wait to see what you all create. Thank you so much for watching and I hope you have a wonderful day.